uh, slow drains throughout the home. Slow drains? Yeah, okay. slow, slow and stuff. Why don't you put that down over there? Okay, come this way. Ding dong. Mm. Hello. Hi, who do I have the pleasure of speaking with today? My name is Joe. Hey Joe, I'm Tom with Davis Home Services. Nice to meet you, Tom. So, what brings us to your house? Right now the drains have stopped working in our house and they're running really slow. Uh, and I don't know what's going on. I can't, we can't live like this, you know. So I was hoping you could take a look at it. Okay, so just to be clear, we're just going to take a look at it and not do any work today? No, no, we got to get this thing fixed. I took off work and everything like that. Okay, so, um, uh, so we should, um, so just to be clear, our, what were your intentions again? What? Yeah, um, I want to get this thing fixed. I took off work and everything like that. So, I mean, I have no, we can't even use the bathtub because just everything, and everything just doesn't drain in the house. Even the kitchen and everywhere, you know, flush the toilets and it goes down slow. It's kind of just uh, creepy, actually. Oh, wow, I'm sorry to hear that. We found the problem. My, uh, my son, Wyatt, he said he couldn't flush the toilet, and I was like, oh, it's just, he's just probably used to much toilet paper, and I tried flushing it and plunging it. It doesn't make a difference. All the toilets are actually running too slow, and then I have some water and floor drain down in the basement. It keep coming through the floor drain, so every time I flush the toilets, there's water that comes up in the floor drain. I didn't have toilet paper that came up to the floor drain, so I don't know what the hell's going on with this thing, you know? So what was that like when you... Uh, it was terrible because I got a I got a bunch of stuff I got going on. I got uh, I'm going to be going to Las Vegas for a big event next week. I have uh, we're, our company is sponsoring a big trade show and uh, we got this big event and I, I got then I got the stuff happening. And my wife, you know, she's going off to a business meeting t today. So I got the two kids, my son Wyatt, who's got eczema, and my uh, niece Karen, who's living here for the summer. But she uh, she they both have eczema skin condition they can't do anything because they're uh you know because they can't take a shower or a bath it's just terrible it's just awful you know wow well can i just say your family's lucky to have you in their life really? that you, you didn't uh, just leave and, and leave them stranded with their drains it's so nice and to say that. smells and it's so nice of you to say something like that well yeah well, that's really good yeah because i'm so i'm just stressed you know what i'm saying i really stressed out the most and i got frustrated you know the most you know well, you want a cup of coffee or something like that? Sure. Let me get you a cup of coffee. Cream and sugar, black. Cream and sugar. Here's the cream and sugar right there. Thank you. Well, let's take a look at this thing. Yeah, here's the you see the drain. See the water in the drain down here. Oh, uh, uh, yeah. Basement, it so. doesn't look so good. No, it's not good. You mind if I take a look around and take and yeah. see what's going on? So yeah. Okay. I, I mean, I have drain cleaning done pretty often. I have uh, about twice a year. This is the second time I've had it now this year. Okay. And twice a year in the spring too. Twice a year. Um, who was the last company you had out? I had Acme Drain Company here right here. Okay, may I ask why they're not here today? I don't want to get into it. Uh, yeah, I wasn't too happy last time, Tom, with the uh, kind of work I got. Well, yeah. Off the record, can I ask why? So I'll make the same mistake. Oh, well, I don't want to get into it, really, but you really have to know. Off the record, if you wouldn't mind. I don't want to make the same mistake they made. Well, off the record, I'll tell you what happened. I had uh, this guy from Acme, and uh, he was, uh, the entire time he was here, he was uh, just kind of creepy. Then I went downstairs and he was uh, smoking a cigarette in my basement. Oh, wow. Did you uh, call the manager on that? Well, I did because, you know, my wife Julie's got asthma and she's, she can't breathe and she could smell the smoke right away in the house. She's like, something's going on in this house. And I went downstairs and the guy's smoking like a chimney down there, you know. Well, and what did the manager say? Uh, the manager said, well, you know, it's hard, you know, he's trying to kick the habit, but, you know, I'll tell him just to kind of dial it back a little bit. And I said, a little bit? I said, this is my house, I don't want to be smoking at all in my house, you know? Yeah, well, did you speak to the owner about it? I tried calling the owner, he wouldn't take my calls. I don't know what he's doing. Oh, geez, I'm sorry to hear that. Yeah. Uh, are you sure it's not maybe just that one uh, guy in the company, you want to try to give him a second chance? No, I'm, I'm done with those guys, I would never... I don't want that in my house any more time. I won't, I won't have that. It's understandable. So what made you decide to call our company? Well, I got your name from a friend of mine uh, who was uh, Roger Godwin, who lives across the street. He's an auto mechanic. Oh, yeah. Very good guy. He told me all about you guys. Oh, well. Um, after this is all done, would you mind if I went over and thanked him for referring you? Oh, you should hear what he said about you. Oh, what did he say? He said you guys were... Uh, you're a very professional company. You're very, the Davis company is just top notch. It's hard to find great people like you. He said that it's the best. You know? oh, some really nice words. 
Would you mind if I went over? Well, you don't mind what he said? Yes. <laughs> yep. He said, uh, he said that you aren't the cheapest company, but you're the best. He said, the best in the entire area. So, not just heating, cooling, and plumbing, but of any kind of a company, you guys are the top notch. That's what he told me. Oh, wow. All, all of New Jersey. Wow. The and best. there's a very nice words, and it's understandable. We're a premium company, so we're going to be a little more expensive than the rest. Mm -hmm. But the quality and, and reliability is what you yeah, do with our company. Well, that's nice. That's nice. Yeah. You, you want a you cup of coffee? Sure, I'll have another cup. Let me get you another cup here. I'll get you a refill. There you Thank go. you. Well, you want to take a look at this and tell me what you find? Yeah. All right. So what'd you come up with here, Tom? Something nice and easy? Well, I'm afraid that <coughs> worse fears. You have a little bit more of an issue than what I thought. Oh, no. What's the problem? The main, main problem is because your drains are slow, I found some fracture faults in your sewer removal system. Oh, Jesus. Typically, they would go on notice. fracture in the system? Yes, and they typically go typically will go unnoticed because you're not filled up with any kind of sewage. No, now no. you have active sewage uh, flowing throughout your basement. Oh my God, that's what that, that's what that is. That brown stuff. Yes, it's it's not healthy, and yeah. especially for your son and your niece. It smells awful. Yes, and it's it's not good <coughs> for their condition. Yeah. What could be done? Can anything be done about it? Well, I did come up with a few options. Well, we start with we have a premium to a mid range. And we also have an economy option. Mm -hmm. uh, would you like me to go over them with you? So what do you got? Tell me what you got. Okay, so starting with our Premium Plus, mm -hmm. we have, we called it Joe's Worry Free Complete Waste Removal Renovation. Mm -hmm. So with that, that comes, we replace all of your sanitary drain lines inside the house all the way out to the your city uh, main down the street. We also, with that, are gonna upgrade all the toilets to comfort height, clog free toilets, uh, for your son and your niece, so when you're gone, you don't have to worry about them ever overflowing. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, with the complete replacement, also, I took into consideration with doing everything inside the house because I didn't want, uh, with your with your son's eczema, mm -hmm. I wanted to make sure you can always take a shower, get clean, stay re uh, refreshed, and try to keep everything down to a minimal. Yeah. And we're also going to give you a 10-year sign <coughs> free uh, guarantee mm -hmm. and a five-year total home care membership with that. Wow, that sounds good. How much are you talking about for all that? How much are you thinking? God, it sounds like $10,000. Triple that. $30,000? How much is that, Tom? Oh, we're actually at 21731 Oh, Whew. Wow. What should we do? <coughs> I, I didn't expect that to be that much money, Tom. That's understandable. Well, we do have a few other options that <coughs> can still get the job done and make sure that your family is uh, have operational bathrooms. Tom, is there a way you can email this whole thing to me and I'll give you a call back like over the weekend? I can do one better. How about we knock that top option? <coughs> what do you mean? How about we knock off that top option so and go with something a little bit um, less premium? No, I like the top option though. It does everything for me. Well, what should we do? Uh, boy. Can you explain that one in the middle for, uh, what's this one here? 15,000. 15,000, What's that one? Okay, so that one. Oh, good choice, Joe. Good, good choice, Joe. What do you like about it? Well, it gives me the two-year warranty. I like that. I like the fact that you're still doing some of the work. It's not quite as good as the other one. I see that. Well, what should we do? Is this competitive? If I shop around, I find it to be competitive. When we do our pricing, we fit it to your needs. So we don't, none of our pricings are ever competitive. We do it specifically for you and only you. Mm -hmm. Okay. What should we do? Um, so if I want that $15,000 one, would I be able to get that done like uh, before the weekend? Because today's Friday already, but at least get the drains flowing. Could at least get the drains going. I mean, I probably won't finish the job, but could I at least get the drains flowing for today? Well, if I said I can clear my schedule up and have a second set of hands to come over today, we can get it knocked out today. What would you think about that? Yeah, I just get it done. I don't want to do that. Okay, what should we do? Let's do that one there. 15345 Let's do that one. All right, you sure we do have other options? Or? No, I want that one there. That's the one I want. Okay. Uh, what should we, uh, how would you like to pay for that? Uh, 
Can you bill me? We can do it. a bill. What's that? With your credit card, we can collect a payment and you oh, can. Okay. That's good. Yeah, I get 30 days on that, huh? Plus, I get my points. Can I use an American Express card? That's a premium card. What, what did you do if I said we couldn't take that card? Yeah, just say yes. Let's do it. What should we do? Let's do it, brother. All right, Tommy. Nice job. Round of applause for Tom. Good job. Nice job there, Tom. You picked up? Did you pick up?